At ACC, we are committed to helping the EU achieve the European Green Deal, climate neutral and zero emission goals by 2050. Solutions like the one we present today will help make this a reality. Gasoline vehicles already have low tailpipe emissions, as the combination of a catalytic converter and a particulate filter in the exhaust reduces the harmful pollutants coming from the engine. Working alongside car manufacturers, ACC member companies continue to search for improvements in the emission control technologies used in vehicles. The aim is to further reduce the air quality impact of the vehicles with a focus on real-world driving and lifetime compliance. The new gasoline demonstrator vehicle being developed by ACC and its project partners showcases that further improvements are now feasible. Whether you're driving in the city, on country roads or on the motorway, once the catalytic converter has reached its operating temperature, ultra-low pollutant emissions are coming out of the tailpipe with the proper system control. A main area for emission control improvement is the time needed for the catalytic converter to reach its operating temperature after the car is started. This operation is the main source of remaining emissions. Vehicles currently in the showroom achieve this start of catalyst operation typically within 20 to 30 seconds. The demo car can achieve this significantly faster thanks to a catalytic converter placed as close as possible to the engine and using advanced controls for the vehicle's emission system. There are other technologies being developed to further reduce the initial time to heat up the exhaust system, even before the engine is starting. This project also measures pollutants which are not yet regulated, but are being considered in the scope of the coming Euro 7 regulation. For example, ammonia, nitrous oxide and sub-23 nanometer particulate number.